Hey everybody, how's it going? Today I'm going to show you how to play a classic Canadian tune, Hello Time Bomb by Matthew Goodband. Now this one's off their 1999 album, Beautiful Midnight, and it's power chords, so it's pretty easy to learn. One thing first, I want you to hit that subscribe button if you're enjoying these videos. Enough of that stuff, let's zoom in and I'll show you how to play Hello Time Bomb by Matthew Goodband. All right, so Hello Time Bomb is a pretty quick and simple song to play. It's really just power chords. So for the intro, they've got a pretty heavy envelope filter effect on there, but what they're actually playing on guitar is a power chord from the second fret up to the fourth fret. So first you wanna cover the A string at the second fret and the D and G strings at the fourth fret for a power chord. And you wanna play that twice. Then you're going to slide that whole shape up and play on the 4th, 6th, and 6th frets three times. So once again, all together, it's like this. From there, you're just going to want to move that whole shape up one string and cover the E string at the 4th fret, the A and D strings at the 6th fret, and do the same thing twice. And the last chord of the intro is a simple E chord. So it's open E and covering the A and D strings on the second fret. And once again, play that part three times. So what you have is For the end of the intro of Hello Time Bomb, there's one quick note that sort of bridges the intro to the chorus. So the last part sounds like this. So you just want to let that second fret power chord ring out going into the chorus. For the chorus of Hello Time Bomb, all you want to do is play power chords and each one is going to be eight times. So you're starting on that fourth fret power chord covering four, six, and six on the D and G strings, fourth on the A string, and play that eight times. Then you're going to move to an A note down here, cover the D and G strings on the second fret, and also play the open A with it again eight times. Then you want to move that whole shape up and play the open E and second fret of the A and D strings. Again, eight times. And the last note of the chorus is back to that second fret uh, power chord shape that's so dominant in this song. So covering the second fret of the A string and fourth fret of the D and G strings. So all together, the chorus sounds like this. Up one, and back to two. Now the only other part of Hello Time Bomb that you need to know is this little bridge part after the chorus. So it's that fourth fret power chord again twice. Once on that A power chord. Once on this power chord, which is the 4th fret of the E string, 6th fret of the A and D strings. So, so far it sounds like this. And then play that E power chord once. And 2nd fret of the E string, 4th fret of the A and D strings. One more time all together, it sounds like this. And it plays that four times. And on the last time, Instead of playing the power chord here, it's down one string. It's similar to that 
bridge part when we first went into the chorus. One more time fast, it's all like this. And back to the intro. guys that's how you play Matthew Goodband's song Hello Time Bomb. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did give it a like and remember to subscribe. That way you'll get the updates right away without having to come back and check all the time. Until next time keep rocking!